Jeff Onofrio is the director of renovation lending for any Mac mortgage company based in New Jersey. And Jeff, welcome to our show. Thanks very much. Hey, Dan. Thanks for having me. A quick comment, though, first, as we get going on the market as a whole. Uh, uh, we, I mean, the, the makeup really is interesting, but are we going to see a change in the makeup of the types of properties being built, you know, any time in the near future? Uh, you know, I'm, I'm not sure about that one, to be honest. Uh, you know, we're seeing, uh, depending upon the, the different areas in the country, uh, you're still seeing a ton of building. Uh, we have a, you know, we have a branch down in Florida. We have a couple branches down in Florida, I should say. And uh, building is hot down there. So it is, and also in North Carolina, and for single family homes as well. Um, oh, okay. so you, yeah, you're seeing it, you're seeing it just, it's just kind of different sectors of the country. I just go off, I, I'm going off of, you know, I, go, I drive around Philadelphia and you see, uh, you know, uh, complexes that are built up in, you know, north of the city in Bucks County and some of the surrounding areas. And you see a lot of like, you know, rows of condominium homes that, that, that are being put up, you know, five at a time, eight at a time, all in one one kind of strip. And, and you know, it just, it, it's a little concerning when you, when you see some of those numbers. But, uh, you know, if the housing numbers are, are, are better in some spots of the country, that's a good thing. Yeah, and Philly's busy in general, though. I mean, you're seeing a building kind of going on everywhere. You drive down any street in Philadelphia, I mean, it's, it's a non-stop building in, in basically every section of the, of the, of the city. Yeah. yeah, it's amazing. Well, and you deal in, in renovation loans, and this is something that maybe is starting to be on the, on the thought process uh, of a lot more people now that we are a few years away from the recession. Uh, what is the general feeling of, of people? Are you starting to see more people come to you and say, hey, listen, I want to upgrade. I want to do this. You know, I want to do something to my house, and I want to look at a different uh, type of a loan or a refinance. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, you know, it's amazing. The, uh, the, 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 the shows uh, such as the Property Brothers and the renovation shows that you see on HDTV, uh, you ask anybody, and everybody watches them. And I think one of the big things is that people just don't know that that money exists to allow them to buy a home, customize it the way they want it. You know, to buy a, a, a house that's you know done or in you know in move-in ready condition, it's somebody else's design. Yeah. So when people are looking at these type of products, they're looking at it going, hmm, I can buy a house that might be on the cheap because it needs work, uh, and they're basically being able to, to build it and, and put in what they want to make it their own type of property. So yeah, we're, we've seen a major increase in the amount of calls about these loans. Uh, we've seen a, a, a much, uh, you know, much higher response rate to some of the marketing that we're doing. There's just a lot of people out there that are interested in hearing about these opportunities. That's good because, uh, you know, I still get the sense, though, that there are, there is a good segment of the, of the, uh, of the communities out there, uh, people that are either looking to do something to their home or maybe they do want to get into the investment game in terms of property, and they're not 100% sure about how to go about it. Sure, and, and, and you know, a lot of the people that are that are reaching out to us are people that are looking at it for their own primary residences. Um, you know, one of the products in particular is the FHA 203K product, and that one is specifically for primary residences. So the investment property sector is a little bit different than the than the primary residential market. Mm -hmm. So, but the primary residential market, you know, there's just a lot of people searching for it. They're trying to figure out how do they get these loans, how do they, you know, where, where how do they work, you know, kind of trying to find the right information. You know, the problem is these programs have been around since the late 70s, but have had you know minimal impact in the market. So we're trying to get a little bit more of the, of the word out so that they understand that they're available to them. Yeah. And uh, you know, these type of TV shows are really making it happen. All right, so let's go through a couple of them. You mentioned the 203K. Let's start there and, and, and talk about what that is and, and where it really can benefit people. Sure, absolutely. I mean, the, 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 the way it works basically is you're, you're either buying or refinancing uh, and, you're, and you're taking the existing first mortgage or the one that you're going to get in your purchase and you're rolling in the cost of renovations and putting it all into one loan. So unlike other types of renovation financing where somebody might go get a home equity line or a second mortgage, yep. this is based upon all around a first mortgage. And uh, you can do just about anything. Um, we've literally done you know, small projects where somebody's just painting and doing some appliances and um, you know, maybe doing some, uh, some minor updates with some bathrooms to the full extent where we've actually taken properties all the way down to the foundation and literally built all the way back up. And you know, these are some of the projects we've done in Philadelphia. The great part about it is you're buying these pro properties and, and, and creating what I like to call instant equity. Um, and we definitely have a lot of different examples of where we've seen that uh, really happen for customers.